Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, David and Scotland. If you're new, please don't forget to subscribe, give me a like, comment, and share. Uh, today we are in Dundee City. I have done a different video before about Dundee, uh, but today, because it's a lovely day, it's so nice, we are like 21 degrees, which is really, really good, and as you guys can see through the windows, it's really, really sunny, and it's fantastic. So today we're gonna go to visit the v &A Museum here in Dundee, and I want you guys to see a little bit of Dundee. So, yeah. So it's really really nice here today, it's about 20-21 degrees, so it's really really hot and we are really really close to um, v &A, the v &A Museum, which is just right there and I will be showing you very shortly this place in Dundee. The city of Dundee is a coastal city located by the River Tay in eastern Scotland. Its regenerated waterfront has two nautical museums. The first one is the RRS Discovery, commonly known as Captain Scott's Antarctic Expedition Ship. And the second one is the Frigate Unicorn, which is a 19th century warship. Right guys, so here in Dundee there is like um, bikes that you can hire and they are quite good to go around the city and this is the kind of bikes that you can hire and you do it through an app so you just log in into the app I think it's, a, it's called Embark Dundee and then you can pay as you go and then you can travel around Dundee which is really really nice Guys, something interesting is that the RRS Discovery was a bar rigged auxiliary steamship built for an Antarctic research launched in 1901 and it was the last traditional wooden three-masted ship to be built in the United Kingdom. Dundee is a city of contrast, it's vibrant and cosmopolitan, but it's also a very friendly city. People here are really friendly. As well, the prices are so good, it's, a, it's an affordable city, and it was the first UK city to be awarded the UNESCO City of Design. Now, let's find out what Scots think about Dundee. Right guys, so I'm here with Erin, and hi Erin, how are you? I'm not bad, how are you? I'm great. Right, so you're from Dundee? Um, I'm from Edinburgh, but I'm living in Dundee. Oh, that's, student, yeah. oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> Being from Edinburgh is a great thing. So the thing is, like, I want to ask you, like, what do you think about living in Dundee, like, compared to Edinburgh, yeah. where you're from? Um, I absolutely love it. It's so sunny here, as you can see today. Um, it's a lot sunnier than Edinburgh. I just think it's such an the nice close-knit community in Dundee it's a lot smaller um, right. so I know everyone so I never yeah. go somewhere without knowing anyone yeah and what yeah. do you think about the v and &E and that I think it's such a gorgeous building um, I think it's brought a lot of tourism to Dundee and it's really raised the um, what Dundee should be and stuff like that you've also got the Eden project going in oh, yes. in 2023 yeah, yeah my true. flat's just above that and I wow. just think that's going to be really really uh, prosperous oh, for the city great. Yeah, yeah that's fantastic well thank you so much for no sharing worries. your experience that's fantastic <laughs> Scotland's fourth largest city is Dundee and it's a fun and vibrant city. The V&A Dundee is Scotland's first design museum now open to the world, presenting the brilliance of Scottish creativity and the best of international designs. 
This museum was opened on the 15th of September 2018. The V&A Dundee is the first design museum in Scotland and the first Victoria and Albert Museum outside London, which I find quite interesting. Guys, in terms of population, Dundee is the fourth largest city in the country and as of 2016 the population was estimated to be 148,270. This museum is really amazing, really nice to come, so I will advise you guys to come into Dundee and definitely visit the v &A Museum. One of the things I really like of Dundee city is that it's the sunniest city in Scotland. So it's really really nice. So every time you come, you'll always find something to do because it's a cosmopolitan city and you'll find places to, to sit down outside in the fresh air, drinking a beer with your friends and family members, just like here outside the V&A Museum. So this is a really really nice plan, something nice to do while visiting the city. Right guys, so I'm here with Luis. Um, I just want to know what he thinks about Dundee. Do you think that Dundee is coming out like one of the cities that is going to be in the up in Scotland and compared to Glasgow and Edinburgh? Well, I think Dundee has always been like the poor, the poor cousin for, for maybe like 20 years or so. But now it's, it's getting on the up, it's getting more money piped down. Um, yeah, I think there's a bit more messenger here as well, so that is good to see. That's great. I'm glad that you like Dundee. Bro Dundee. I'm a bit thirsty, so I'm going to go and have a wee drink and then we'll continue with the tour. As you guys can see, Dundee is a really fun place to be and it's going definitely on the up. So, well done Dundee. As I mentioned earlier, the v &A Dundee Museum is the first design museum in the UK outside London and it's fantastic. It's a really, really nice place to come and visit. The amazing thing here is that you can visit for free, free of charge, and it's located at the heart of the city. And it's really nice. There's lots of things to do in the city. You get fantastic shops and everything is so near, so close, because it's not a big city, but it's a nice city. So it's definitely a place to come. After having visited interesting landmarks such as the v &A Museum here in Dundee City, I leave you and I hope you guys like the video. Please give me a like, comment down below and you know the rest. So see you next time. Bye bye.